Immediately, police sealed off Waldrop Road on either side of a bridge over the river near where the body was found. Investigators from the FBI and the Atlanta Missing Children's Task Force were on the scene within minutes. Teams of DeKalb County firemen were assigned to comb the area for clues, picking up whatever they could find in plastic bags. They were joined by 23 new recruits from the DeKalb Police Academy who fanned out into the woods on either side of the river. About 4.30, a fiberglass stretcher was sent to the bridge, and soon afterward, the body was taken by ambulance to the DeKalb County Medical Examiner's Office for identification. There was some momentary excitement when police took a young Hispanic man into custody. But it was later learned that police only wanted to escort him away from the crime scene after a store owner in the area reported that he was creating a disturbance. He was questioned briefly, then released. For hours, reporters awaited word of who the young child in the river might be, and Hank Phillippe was at DeKalb County Police Headquarters when that announcement was finally made.